Okay, so I just came across this video that got recommended to me on YouTube. It has 21 million views. And it, it was uploaded only five days ago. So that's, that's a pretty good view count. It's getting over 4 million views every single day. And it's got 2 million likes. And it was so... It's so blatantly fake that I, I saw everyone having a great time and enjoying this uh, wholesome video that I thought I should sit here and uh, mock and destroy it. So yeah, first I'll play the clip and then, because it's very short, and then I will just go back and, and explain like the 10 different things that are blatantly fake about this. When this delivery driver dropped off packages at this house, she noticed a sign that had been left for her. It stated, My son is coming back from school. Today is his birthday. I work two jobs, so I can't make it. I left $200 under the mat. One package has his gift, second one has Mickey Mouse. The sign then asked if the delivery driver would help her surprise her son by dressing up as Mickey Mouse and delivering his present. Without hesitation, the woman immediately started putting on the costume, knowing that the son would be there at any moment. When the son finally returned from school, he got so excited, running up to Mickey and giving him a big hug. A small wholesome moment which shows there is still good in this world. Okay, yeah, so very wholesome video, as you guys can see. It shows, up, shows us that there's still hope in this world, and the comments are eating this up. The best part is that she took the time to do something special for somebody else, and she made the boy's birthday really special. Became she to the initiative to make his birthday amazing? That is just awesome. The fact she did it and not just take the money and leave is so wholesome. The most thing that's got to be appreciated is that she had no hesitation and immediately took on the suit. Okay, so yeah, let's get into uh, debunking this video. Uh, first thing, the kid got, as you saw at the end of the video, so there were two packages delivered. A Mickey Mouse costume and a PS5. One, it's kind of unlikely that those would show up at the same time, but I guess that's possible. Uh, the more glaring issue is why is the PS5 showing up in a Home Depot box? Uh, neither of which have delivery instructions on them, so I don't know how she knew to get to this house. Uh, thirdly, instead of just a normal note that somebody would leave for them to read, there is giant foot-long paper positioned exactly where the camera is. That way we can make sure the viewer can read what's happening. And instead of the delivery driver doing what would be common sense, you know, standing in front of it and reading it, she decides to read it from like a 45 degree angle really far away and even though she doesn't know there's a camera there, she happens to read it in this weird way exactly where it wouldn't cover up the camera. Also, luckily we can know it's been exactly 21 seconds since this recording started since all security cameras have a stopwatch at the top right instead of a date and time so that you have no idea when this was recorded. You just know, oh, my good thing my security camera started 21 seconds ago. What are we on, five or six? And it's like 10 seconds into the video? Uh, what company does this woman work for? Uh, you would think it was Home Depot since the PS5 came from Home, De Home Depot, but that's not what their delivery drivers look like. Uh, she doesn't work for Amazon. She doesn't work for UPS. She doesn't work for FedEx. So yeah, I'm not entirely sure who she's delivering this from. If any of you have ever had something delivered to your house before, uh, you know the time frame is really big, to the point that it can be like two days later. I've had multiple Amazon deliveries that were supposed to be delivered within the next hour, and then like 10 minutes before delivery, I get an email saying it's going to show up two days later. So it sure is strange that this mom that has to work two jobs somehow knew when it was being delivered before she left. And once again, that awesome stopwatch feature in the top right corner, we can see very clearly she finishes getting dressed at 3 minutes and 30 seconds, which is pretty fast. And when the sun within 7 seconds. So not only did she show up like before the sun got home, but within 7 seconds of getting dressed and finally returned from school. Really? So if, if he had been seven seconds earlier, or more likely, what if he came like an hour later and she got fired from her generic company that she doesn't work for? Really? 
They want us to believe he showed up seven seconds after she got dressed. Yeah, I saw 21 million people having a good time, and I thought I should do something about that. So remember to just have some critical thinking skills.